Thomas is a tank engine who lives at a big station on the island of Sodor. He's a cheeky little bastard, eh? With six small wheels, a short stumpy funnel, what? A short stumpy boiler, hey! And a short stumpy, oi! Knock it off! What? The insult was bad enough, but I really hate being described like I'm some kind of object. Thomas, you are an object. Oh, yeah. Um, carry on. Ah, forget it. Just go to the next scene. <laughs> Thomas is a fussy little engine too. Oh, come on. Always pulling coaches about, ready for the big engines to take on long journeys. And when trains come in, he pulls the empty coaches away so the big engines can go and rest. Lazy sods. Thomas also has a chip on his shoulders because he thinks he's the only one who does any damn work on the island. This often puts him at odds with the other engines, especially Gordon, the biggest engine of them all. If you don't count the challengers, we don't! Thomas likes being rude to Gordon. Furthermore, whenever the big blue engine tried to rest after a hard day's work, Thomas would usually play a trick on him, like setting his tender on fire. One day, Gordon had enough and decided to pay Thomas back. His chance came the following morning. Thomas had just brought a line of coaches to the platform. By happy chance, Gordon was directly behind him. Without delay, he charged towards Thomas. He collided with the cheeky bastard at a fantastic speed, smashing him into the coaches. Thomas was dazed and confused. Gordon, why'd you do that? He exclaimed. Well, little Thomas, he began, you need to understand the folly of picking a fight with someone bigger than you. In hindsight, that is kind of stupid, but not nearly as stupid as what you just did. And why is that? Because there were people in that coach. Oh, bother. Bother.